Hey guys, this is that guy's Baker and Josh, and welcome back to another episode of the Dark Souls 3 walkthrough. We left off, we just completed the first part of the Irithyll dungeon, and now we're gonna progress through and finish this place. Because, let's see, we only have um, one, two, three, four. Hold up, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven bosses left. Think. Oh, eight. Eight. We have eight bosses. So we're getting there. We're getting there. We're almost done. So I'm really excited because the Uncharted game is so cool. But that's not what we're here about today. It's not. So last episode we talked to the Seagrid over there. We need to unlock him. We need to find a key. And that's what we're going to do this episode. We're going to find that key, hopefully. Actually, we, I don't know if we will, but we're going to get to the place where we can find the key in the next episode. That's what's definitely going to happen. Is we're going to find the key within these next two episodes. And we're going to free Seagrid. And everybody's going to be happy. And then we can, we can just be free, man. We can just be free. Sweet! Got ourselves a chunk. Let's see, how many chunks do we have? Got one chunk, okay. And we need four chunks. We need four chunks to upgrade. So, we're gonna need to stockpile some chunks, man. you will need to stockpile on some chunks. So, careful here because if you go all the way up here, you will need to turn around. I think it's after you open up the first chest. I think. Yep, okay, here we go. <clears throat> Got ourselves some basilisks now. So, gotta deal with these guys. Oh no, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna I'm gonna die. Okay, so once you order the first chest, these basilisk things will spawn. I died from them already. So our goal is to try to kill them now. Without dying. Let's not do that. Oh gosh. <laughs> I absolutely hate curse in this game. It's so bad. Nope, nope, nope. Not today, Frodo. Nope. Mm -mm. I'm not dealing with being cursed again. I died. You guys have seen it. It's not fun, but now it's time to kill this mimic over here. We're gonna try to get a symbol of avarice again because I really want it. I'm gonna undead hunter. Alrighty. Oh, hold up. No, shield of want only gives a. Uh, Soul discovery. I'd rather put on the shield of one in order to uh, try to get more item discovery, but it's only soul discovery. All right, clutch ring. No symbol of avarice. Golly, dude, I just want it. It's such a good item to have. It is such a great item to have, but we're not getting lucky enough. Okay. So now I'm just gonna go in this hole over here. This is where we're gonna spend a lot of our time because, um,. I absolutely hate this next part of the I it, it's it's so bad. It is so bad. Okay, here we go. Open sesame. 
shit. You, do you see me? Hey. Hey. Come on. You gotta like lure a couple of them at first. And then once they like, once you lure a couple of them. Oh, no, 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 no. Once you lure a couple of them, you can take them out in a, in a big group. And as you can see, we're, we're clearly not getting that lucky. Alright, how, 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 what's the best plan of action here? You! Challenge me! Come on. Alright, this is good. We're making progress. You! I attracted two of them. Okay. Alright. Come on. Come on, come in here. Alright, now you get Riggedy Rex fan. You! This might be dangerous. Most likely is dangerous. But this is how we're gonna handle these guys now. Yo, no way you can see me. No way. I have it. Sneaky dicky. Sneaky dicky. Yep. Yeah, we sneaky dicky them, dude. Sneaky dicky. No, bro. Bro. Sneaky dicky. Okay. We did it! Yay! And now we can go grab ourselves another shortcut. And we can be a little happier with ourselves and our lives. Grab ourselves the Dragon Torso Stone. And here we go! We can uh, grab us ourselves another shortcut. Really awesome, because we need more shortcuts in this place, because now we don't have to go through all the jailers and stuff if we end up dying again. Actually, no, we still do. Crap. We still need to do that, but... It's alright, though. It's okay, because we got our shortcut, and I'm a little happier now that we have a shortcut. A little happier. But we're almost done. Just got a couple more rooms to explore, and then... Oh, man. Then we're going to be done. So, awesome stuff. We'll come back to this place later. We will, don't worry. We'll come back here. We'll come back. Alright. Little derpy physics going on over here. Okay, cool. Now we're gonna work on getting things done. Into ooh, okay, you, you dead. You, you dead. Come on, you weird dragon baby looking thing. You dead. Come on. Come on, bring your little magic stick over here. Ow! Who do they think they are, dude? Who do they think they are? Alright, now we got ourselves the profane coal, so that's pretty awesome stuff. We can just open our way through now. I don't know if we can open up one of the cell doors, because I think we need a... Um, special key which we'll get later I forgot there's another jailer great challenge me freaking lames dude okay can we open up this gate yet no we can't okay we'll come back there because that's an NPC that we're gonna bring back to fire the shrine who can accept the uh, like, grave warden pyromancies and whatnot so yay <laughs> Die, 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 die. Oh, God! Die. Hey! 
play my shard. And any walls. Yes. No, I don't really never understood that this place. So if there is a wall and I missed it, I'm sorry. I don't know what, what to look for. I don't. You can come over here. It should be yeah, we're good. Xanthus ashes. And the best crown ring. And another jump scare. You gotta love the jump scares in Dark Souls, because that's what we all play this game for. Okay. I'm not going to put on the gold coin. I'm not going to. No matter how much I want it, I'm not going to do it. It's not worth waiting. It's not worth worth wasting. But if I could speak, and if I could speak, it's not worth wasting a gold coin because I'm not going to get it. I'm not going to. Okay, so we are essentially done with the Irithyll dungeon as of this point. Essentially, we still got to go back and get that NPC. And open up a couple some a couple of the doors, but that can be done after we beat this next area, or whenever we get the key essentially. So, I guess we can go back after we get the key and then beat the area. But I honestly don't know really what when we should go back. Okay, come on, Mr. Gargoyle, do you want to tussle, mate? You want to tussle? Let's uh, let's tussle, mate. Let's tussle. Gargoyles are really fun in this game. They're not hard. The lance ones are honestly the easiest one. They have like a scepter one. Those are the more difficult ones because they have like fire arrows and whatnot. <gasps> Ooh. Ooh. I have never gotten that. I can use it. It's an E, D, E, and E. So this thing scales with everything. Oh, baby. That's awesome. So I guess if we put a, re a refined ore on it, it would increase the scaling for everything. Dude, that thing would be dangerous. Oh my. Yeah, dude, imagine that. Like having that thing fully upgraded and then putting a refined gem on it. That would be mental. It would be so much damage. Oh man. Oh man, oh man. Not again, okay. Stretch out an undead bone shard. And now we are in the profane capital. We had the bonfire. We're gonna go back to Firely Shrine and level up, get our undead bone shard, and it's probably gonna be the end of this episode. Okay, so these are our stats right now level 62, 17 vigor, 11 attunement, 15 endurance, 10 vitality, 28 strength, 31 dexterity. It's actually 28 and 28, but because of the rings I have on, my dexterity increased, so there, that's, that's why it's like that. And then we have uh, 10 intelligence, 12 faith, and then 10 luck. Well, this is going to be where we end off this episode. Hope you guys enjoyed it, and if you did, make sure to drop a like, comment, and subscribe. And all the fun stuff, if you haven't, remember it's all free, and it takes about a second for each of those things to be done. And as always, I'll see all of you all in the next video. Until then, peace.